Hey guys, I'm here to show you how to set up custom extension thumbnails so your avatars end up looking like this instead of this. Let's jump right into it. First off though, this is a community made tutorial and you are welcome to check my social media links down in the description. And if you have any questions about the tutorial or any other feature stream avatars might have, you can join my streams and ask any questions. I am live every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. And the link for that is in the description. Now without of that, that out of the way, let's jump right into it. Alright, so what you're going to want to do is head over to the avatars and gears section on the program. Then come over to this little cogwheel icon up here, click on it, then click create thumbnail. And then we are going to find the folder with our thumbnails and we are just going to double click on the thumbnail we want to set and then click continue and it is the same exact method for gear pieces you just click on the cogwheel right here on the gear piece click create thumbnail find the thumbnail click continue and as you can see your custom thumbnail is now working and as you can see custom color palettes will also affect the thumbnail if it matches the avatar colors and if we head over to the head gear over here, we can see the wizard hat gear is working just fine too. Also keep in mind, thumbnails are going to have to be 62 by 62 pixels or anything above or below that will not work. And there you go, that is how you set custom thumbnails for your stream avatars. If you like that tutorial, maybe hit that like button and maybe also consider subscribing for more tutorials like this in the future. And like I said before, you can find the rest of my social media down in the description down below. I've been Torex, and I'll see you all next time. Have a good day, guys. Peace. Remember when I said that was an easy boss fight? Oh, no. And guess what? When I die in game, I get damaged.